PC Perspective's coverage of CES 2016 is brought to you by Logitech. See the latest gaming peripherals at gaming.logitech.com. Hey everybody, we're here looking at the new Lenovo IdeaPad Y900. This is actually their first true gaming laptop designed from the, from the ground up to be a gaming machine. Uh, and you can see it has a lot of the qualifications that make up a good gaming laptop at this time. Full RGB keyboard, uh, we can actually change through profiles and that type of stuff. Uh, you can modify all this to your heart's content. Specification-wise, you're looking at an Intel 6th Gen up to quad-core, Core i7 overclockable processor. You have a 17.3-inch 1080p display. It's an IPS, kind of an anti-glare, not quite matte finish, but somewhere in between uh, the high gloss and the, the matte finish. Windows 10, obviously, you can get up to 64 gigs of memory. There are four DIMM slots in this, which means you have the capability to do upgrading yourself after the fact if you want to save some money that way. Uh, it supports two storage options. You can do uh, a, a, a SATA 3, you know, typical two and a half inch hard drive up to one terabyte. It also supports up to 512 gigs SSD through a PCIe connection, which is really nice. Uh, battery life, they're claiming five hours. That's something that's always kind of iffy on gaming machines. Uh, in terms of graphics, it will support up to the GTX 980M, so they'll have lots of variants in between that. Uh, you've got 2.1 by two channel speakers here, JBL with a subwoofer. Uh, you've got three USB 3.0 ports, USB 2 with always on charging. Uh, there's even a USB Type-C on here, uh, HDMI 2.0, which is nice as well. Comes in weighing 10.1 pounds. It'll be available in June of this year. They say prices starting at... 1999. Now that doesn't include the GTX 980M or the highest end processor or 512 gig SSD, obviously. So we'll have to see what components you get for 1999. Uh, but very interested to try out uh, Lenovo's first true entry into the gaming notebook market.